Hi, this is lesson number 16 from our Photoshop training series. In our previous lesson, we learned about masking. In this exercise, we will go a little bit further. We will use masking to select the complex here, such as this in the picture you can see. Previously, we learned different selection methods, such as uh, selection with the polygon tool, with the lasso tool, or making quick selection. But these all methods are not applicable here polygon tool or lasso tool we can use here as a helper tool but the main role will play the masking if i will select the quick selection and try to extract the hair from the background you can see there is a hair from the edges we are missing this way control d to deselect and even if we will use a polygon tool it is not possible to select the here properly this way so here we really need to use the mask and this is very simple and easy trick to make selection with the here all what we need to do to make rough selection with the polygon or lasso tool here in our toolbox the polygon tool is selected i am going to select the lasso tool first and i will just make rough selection this way All right, we have rough selection around here, but in lower portion, in the shoulder, we need to select more precisely. So here we can use polygon tool. Click on polygon tool, make sure add to selection is selected. And just carefully add selection this way. In our previous lesson, we learned how to use the polygon tool. And once we will click on the first point, I will be able to add the new selection in the previous. Here in this area, if we want, uh, we can push the selection a little bit, but we need to click on subtract from selection. All right. So simply we selected the area with the lasso tool and polygon tool open the layer palette and here we have our image the first thing we need to duplicate the layer to keep original so here i am going to drag my layer on this plus icon and since the selection is there i am going to add mask simply click on add layer mask so the first thing we are going to switch off the background layer we switch off the background so we can see the transparency in our layer palette we have different right click if i will right click in this area you can see all options associated with this layer we have here and if i will go to the image and right click these options are associated with the thumb if i will right click on mask thumb i will get all option that's related to the masking and here we need to click on select and mask once i will click on select and mask you will observe in my screen here we have small toolbox and refine edge brush tool is selected it is selected by default and we need to make selection with this the most right side here we have option in your case it might be this way you need to scroll up to see these controls here we have view view mean how you can view the image with the masking in the canvas so here we can click on this drop down we can make onion skin it will be this way if we want to see only the masking you can click on black and white i will recommend overlay click on overlay little bit we have transparency this is what we can control here this is the color if we want we can change i will leave it similar and here we have opacity if i will increase it will be this way so that is fine all the option here for now I'll leave as it is refine edge brush tool is selected all what you have to do you need to select the color that you want to remove from the background this is the color the light gray we need to remove from the background so you need to click on that color and hold your mouse left click and hold and just drag the mouse over the hair 
but you don't need to really go inside just keep your mouse as much possible around the edges after this you need to click on decontaminate color if this option is checked only layer mask on the current layer will be disabled but it's fine we can click on new layer with layer mask all right and then click ok that's all you can see that we have beautiful almost perfect selection and here we have simple mask above is the changes we made in select and mask property so this layer we can delete click and drag here if I want to add another layer under masking I need to click on the background this is already selected I will click on this icon create new layer now this layer is under masking and here we have a sky blue color this color most of the time we are using for passport size photo uh, of course this image is not intended for that but I will just fill this color the color is selected if you want to change you can click here and choose your desired color and click OK so it will be your foreground color to add foreground color in the selected layer all you need to do is to press alt and backspace alt backspace and that's all in this area you can observe here we have little bit background element we need to right click on the mask again select and mask and once again simply click in this area and we are going to just add this new changes so we can select here layer mask so it will remain on the same layer click OK so the background color is cleared from this area and the lower part of the image it is selected with the polygon tool having really sharp edges around of course there is a lot of improvement we can do in the masking but at this point as a beginner it is more than enough if you can come up this much with the hair selections try to use this masking technique on the similar image select the hair area roughly with the lasso tool after selecting the hair with the lasso tool once you will click on the polygon tool you need to make sure that add to selection is checked then you select the shoulders this way the lower area more precisely once the selection is added you need to select the duplicate and then add layer mask then right click on the mask thumb and select the option select and mask and go ahead with the process that's all for now i hope you enjoy this lesson and try to practice guys if you like my video please subscribe my channel and click on the bell button so you will always get notification once i will upload new video thank you